Hey, what's up, guys? Today we'll be talking about the progressive stage of shock. It's your boy. So, um, the progressive stage of shock is the second stage of shock. From the non-progressive, if you don't treat it, it goes to the progressive. If you don't treat the non, uh, the, the the progressive, it goes to the irreversible, which you will die. Okay. So now, this is caused by a vicious cycle of cardiovascular deterioration. This includes some of the positive feedbacks that further depress the cardiac output in the shock, thus causing the shock to become more progressive. Some of the most important feedbacks are the following. There's cardiac depression, that's when the arterial pressure falls um, below, um, falls low enough, okay? Coronary blood flow decreases that, re that is required for adequate nutrition of the myocardium. This weakens the heart muscles and therefore decreases the cardiac output more. Thus, a positive, uh, positive feedback is developed, okay? As the cardiac cells are dying, the function is reducing, okay? So, you have to treat it so far. This is the pathophysiology of uh, shock, right? I would like to use um, a better image that is um, on the front, okay? It's an image from our professor. Now, there's vasomotor failure, so that... There comes a point when diminished blood flow to the brain vasomotor center depresses the center so much that it becomes progressively less active. And finally, totally inactive. Loss of sympathetic discharge. Too. Okay, so um, this is uh, the image that I prefer using uh, for what? Um, for progressive shock. There's acute loss of 10% to 15% of blood, and there's severe reduction in um, venous um, return. There's severe reduction in cardiac output. Now, there's severe decrease in what? Blood pressure. Okay? Now, this will what? Um, result in, um, we're taking the pathway on uh, the left now. Uh, there's severe, uh, severe myocardial ischemia. Um, there's release of toxin from damaged cardiac tissues. There's further deterioration in cardiac function. There's deterioration of other tissues. Uh, fluid diffusion into interstitial space. There's um, increased capillary permeability. Okay. There's suppression of um, vasomotor center. There's severe vasodilation. Uh, there's further decrease in blood pressure. There's a thrombus formation in capillaries. There's obstruction in capillary blood flow. There's an um, increased capillary hydrostatic pressure, okay? And this is like progressive, progressive, progressive. If uh, rapid attention is not given, this will result into death. Now, um, how does the uh, um, blockage of small vessels result into the progressive shock? There's a sludged blood, um, sluggish blood flow from the micro vessels um, there's deposition of lactic acid, carbonic acid, that's a product of metabolism, and there's deterioration of products from the ischemic tissues, cause local blood agglutination, resulting in mini blood clotting. This uh, leads to what mini plugs in the blood vessels. This will what in turn what cause what reduction in blood flow. Okay. So, um, how does it handle the increased capillary permeability? This occurs at uh, the late stage of the prolonged shock. The capillary permeability increases and large quantity of fluid begins to transude into the fluid, okay? That's when the individual starts swelling up, literally, okay? Um, this increases, uh, this decreases uh, blood volume, which will further decrease the cardiac output, okay? Um, there's generalized cell deterioration. Um, you know, when there's accumulation of lactic acid, carbonic acid, potassium, your cells will deteriorate. Then acidosis, we say that poor delivery of oxygen greatly diminish oxidative meca metabolism of foodstuffs. Okay. Cell obtain energy by anaerobic process, and um, this causes excess quantities of lactic acid in blood okay um cell obtain energy by anaerobic process and this cause excess quantities of lactic acid in blood okay 
I'll see you guys in the next tutorial and bye for now. See your boy. Yeah. Subscribe to my YouTube channel if you haven't. Bye for now.